for you. Well, it's for me, not you, but <laughs> this is a Diamond Art Club that I purchased on Cyber Monday. So I had already uh, purchased the Black Friday stuff. More stuff came out, um, but then I got on Cyber Monday a 35% off coupon. So I was like, oh God. <laughs> so I went back through some older, not they're not old, none of, nothing on that side is old, but I went back through some prior releases to some that I had um, thought that I really might want to purchase, and I purchased them. So uh, I bought two. This is one of two. I'm just, I will do separate unboxings. But I'm so excited about this one, but it is huge. What is it with me in huge diamond paintings? I don't know. So uh, 98 by 70. Piece of cake, right? Oh, what a but I'm anxious to see the colors on this thing. It is, um, it has ABs. All right, let's take off this outer package. So now it did come in a, a, a cardboard box. The two, uh, I ordered two, and they both came together in a cardboard box. So very well protected, uh, delivered by the post office, U.S. Postal Service. Um, as you can see, in great condition. So. Um, I'm liking the outer packaging. Garbage. I have to get a garbage can for in here. It's crazy that I don't have one. So, of course, I ordered squares. Um, so that's what this blue um, uh, on the box indicates is that you're getting square. I think ra uh, round is red. Um, there's a coupon. If you scan this, you can get 10% off your next purchase. There are six steps to diamond painting on the back. Um, the contents of the kit are <laughs> way up here. <laughs> Sorry, you can't see it. Oh my word. Um, there is a picture of the painting on the front, but I'm not going to show it to you yet. So let's see what's in the box. I'm so excited about this one. Um, the artist is David McLean. I don't know what it is. Dominic Davison and David McLean. I am loving their stuff. I really am. I'm, I'm happy that Diamond Art Club has signed them. Or at least has some of their artwork. Very cool. Very cool. Okay. Here we go. Oh my goodness. All right. We always get a bunch of goodies inside. Okay. We're going to put the box over here. Put that there, put that there. So what we have is the square toolkit. Everybody is pretty fairly familiar with the square toolkit. The really only recent change to the square toolkit um, or to the toolkit in general is that they are now putting in a skinny pork placer, which we all love before we discovered the everlasting tip. But uh, if I didn't have the everlasting tip, my first choice would be the skinny pork placer. So you know, kudos to that, but you get the, tw the sharp tweezers, the pen, the squishy, the boat with the funnel, the um, baggies, and the squinny, the squinny, the skinny floor placer. Um, I have everlasting tips and I love them. We'll see how long everlasting is, is um, you know, could be years, could be months, could be till I get another pen, who knows? Oh my word, this is, okay, so you also got a sticker sheet. Um, let me show you, sticker sheet. So it comes with a picture of the painting, which I'm not showing you yet. Um, the picture you can put on your storage container, I would suggest you tape it. Uh, these stickers are not removable stickers, unfortunately. Um, but the schematic is quite clear. You can put the, those on your storage containers. And I use the Harbor Freights, and if I use my nails, I can get off what doesn't come off. But um, if not, run it through your Zyron sticker maker. But here is the symbols. As you can see, oh my, why I'm shaking too much coffee. So we're getting a blue AB-137 and a white AB-141. Wow. We're really shaking today. Too much caffeine. 
I was out crocheting, watching Dateline, and having lots and lots of caffeine. Yes, there we go. There's all the symbols. You know, nothing um, out of the ordinary for Diamond Art Club. You also got a smaller version of the sticker to put on your box if you store your uh, paintings in the box separately. Big paintings like this, I will not put back in the box. I could put it back in the box, but I generally, I hang them up. Yeah. Um, I, I like to use a roll keeper for the smaller paintings, but actually this, this may fit on the roll keeper. The width doesn't seem that bad. I think it's the length that's, sometimes the width is too large and you can't put it on the roll keeper. Anyway, we'll put that off to the side. We're going to roll it this way so we can look at the drills just really quick. This is the uh, the tarmaline patented canvas. Very, very soft. Um, it has the beveled edges to prevent fraying. There's like this weird thing on my computer I'm trying to get rid of. Oh my goodness, it's, it's a big one. Let's go this way. <laughs> and it will lay flat very quickly. You could fold this, th I wouldn't recommend folding it, but you could roll it up and bend it and, and then come back and lay it flat and it'd be beautiful within, you know, 10, 15 minutes. It's just a gorgeous, um, you know, material that they make this canvas out of and it feels so good. It's like got this soft velvety feel to it. So here are the drills. Look at these amazing colors. Look. Wow. I see like some 995, 996 in there. Gorgeous. Gorgeous colors. And I can add more ABs if I want to. So you also got the step by step instructions to diamond painting, which has a very nice letter uh, thank you for purchasing from the owner it has the instructions it has another uh, coupon for 10 percent off tips and tricks and ways to contact them through social media and otherwise all right white ab's Woo okay we'll look at those in a minute one thing i do like about the drills is they're labeled uh, with the name of the painting. So now you're going to see the name of the painting. This is Russia with Love. It has the number of the painting, the name of the painting, and this is one of two packages. And this would be the same thing, two of two packages. So I do store my drills separately, so that's a great thing. All right, let's take a look. Oh my god. Wow, guys. Holy moly. Uh, I don't know if I'm going to get it all in the camera. Oh, we got most of it in. Look at that. Oh, it's gorgeous. It's gorgeous. Oh, my God. So look at this tree. All of that white in this tree is the ABs, the white ABs. Now, the blue ABs, let's see if we can find those. I think I want to put ABs in this. What is it? Is it a castle? What is it? It's gorgeous. It really is. I'm going to tuck this down here. There's some more ABs in, maybe it's a, I don't, did they call it a mosque? What do they call this in Russia? We have to figure that out. But I'm going to put more ABs here. Absolutely. Um, especially in these towers here. So there is the number one up in here, the blue AB. There's some of it here. It doesn't look like there's a lot of it. There's some like right here and here. But I want to add more focus on this structure. Look at the person down here. Do you see? Look at this. There's a person here. She's wearing dark hose. I love it. Um, and heels. <laughs> Here's a little bench here. There's a um, horse here in the background. There's a horse in the foreground. 
what else do we got here? Let's look for some more stuff. Oh my God, this is beautiful. This right here, these lamps, I like to illuminate them with the sparklers. I will get like some yellow. There, number two is in here. The white is in here, but I will also put the yellow. I'll make, I'll put yellow ABs in theirs. And this is a square painting, but you can, DPU with sparklers has sparklers for square paintings. So check that out. And you can replace yours with, oh my God, look at the columns up here. Is that columns or rooms? Oh, look at the moon. Oh my gosh. Wow, is that beautiful. Now all up here, dispersed, there's little bits of AB here, the number two. But then there's also little bits of this other color that's not an AB that I think I would like to make an AB. Um, and what I'm talking about is Aurora Borealis. That's a, that's a, um, it's an acrylic diamond that has an iridescent coating to it, and it just kind of brings your eye into, you know, wherever you place it. Um, gorgeous, gorgeous painting. So I'm guessing these are rooms or balconies or roofs. I, I can't really tell. Maybe until we've done the painting. Oh my God, this is so beautiful. Now, when am I going to get to it? I don't know. But look at that. Oh. Wow. And I'm loving this tree. I just, I really do love this tree. Now, is there, there's an, oh, look at the older couple here. And another bench. And then this is another light. Another light here. So beautiful. Very, very beautiful. Oh, this up here. I would want to get like some gold um, Aurora Borealis, just, you know, make that pop. That would be really great. All right, we're gonna roll it back up. I may put this back in the box. Um, it's just, I don't, I don't like when it bubbles like that, but that's easy, it's an easy fix, it really is. Um, I won't do it on camera, but yeah, I can fix that. It doesn't do anything. Uh, this is a poured glue. It has really no uh, no effect on the poured glue, um, except that the the glue separates a little bit and it doesn't get as sticky. Um, so I, I like to make sure that that plastic is sticking to the glue. This is 55 colors, guys. There is a schematic on both sides of the canvas, so you can actually you could sit and work on it this way or this way and you've got your schematic here and then as you're working and you go the other way um, you're not obviously not rolling it inward you're going to roll it outward but there you've got another schematic on the other side so kudos to DAC so let's look at the drills how much 310 Let's see. <laughs> I was the last painting I unboxed was 14 dies of three ton. Let's see what we got here. I am not going to show you every color, um, but I want you to get an idea. So we've got one, two, three bags of three ten there. Some. 3371, this beautiful 796 here, 820. So those are your like your usual colors in a painting. Um, of course, we've got pink. It's like a pinkish purple. Do you see that right there? So pretty. That is 210. And then we've got a lavender, a couple of bags of oh, 939, which is a beautiful like a deep aqua color. This is not one you see very often, this 900. Lots of this, oh my God, 3853. Three bags of that color, this color here. Wow. More purples, lots of purples. Different shades of purple, you see the different shades of the purple there? 
and some more blue. $7.97, a couple of bags of that. That's a stunning blue. And we're going to put that back. So the ABs are in the other bag. <laughs> I hope you guys are having a great Christmas season. I am crocheting my little butt off because I don't have a lot of money this year, so people are getting crochet gifts. Or um, if they diamond paint, they're getting diamond painting gifts. I actually um, purchased some diamond painting some, for some close friends. Because, you know, share the addiction. Why not, right? <laughs> okay. Wow, this is not a usual color here. This 720, look at that. Very pretty. So here is the white AB, the 141. Look at it sparkle. So you can see that iridescent coating on it. Oh, uh, wow, we've got like this orange sherbet here. I'm just going to go ahead and take these off because these are some really, really stunning colors. Oh, my word. <laughs> this is very unusual. Two bags of ABs, white ABs. I've seen Diamond Art Club like put maybe 5, 10, 15 of these in a bag, and then that's it. Um, two bags of these. So you got this dark 939, another lavender here. I like this, it's kind of like a sherbet. 823, now you don't want to, I have mixed this up with 820. Not a, not a good mix up. Uh, I remember having to take this off. To, uh, I had put 820 on. I had to take the 820 off and put the 823 on. Never again. Yeah. <laughs> nice blues. Oh my God. Look at this orange. Isn't that beautiful? So, so pretty. That is 3341. I don't know that I've used that. Here's a deep green. We haven't seen much green in this painting. So Diamond Art Club gives you their diamonds, they um, package them by weight. So these are the ones that have like the heavier weights of diamonds. These are the mediums, these are the smaller weights. And also probably the brighter colors. Oh, something in my eye. So here's some browns. Oh, look at this lavender here. Gorgeous. That is 37.46. Some more brown. I can't find the blue AB. Oh, I found it. I found it. See, look at these teeny weeny bits of color here. 3846. Just to run these by the camera, they're really pretty colors. There is the blue AB. See, it's not many in there. You don't have a lot of those in the painting. See the sparkle on them? That's why I may add some more ABs to this. Oh, I look at that one. Very pretty. 775. I'm going quickly on these. Because there's 55 colors. Oh my word. So I only saw. Wow. I only saw one pink. That's okay. This picture is just amazing. And yes, I do know how to put all this back. <laughs> And I will. All right, let me go ahead and show you the sticker. This is the way it looks. I had it folded over. There is the painting, the finished painting right there. Isn't that cool? Look at all those lights. Look at all those opportunities for sparklers. Ooh, loving it. Loving it. And the other sticker fell on the floor. But, I mean, it looks like this, except a smaller version. So, guys, thanks for coming on this journey with me and sharing Russia with love. I will do part two. Um, look for that. That's the next painting that I purchased on Cyber Monday. And the holiday continues. Take care.